Right, so what I'm trying to cut is either right on that line there or just outside of it. <laughs> to saw this guy, what I'm going to do is um, saw with the lines across like this. When I get that little nick down, I'm going to drop my saw and start sawing this way as far as I can go. When I hit that bottom line or close to it, I'm going to start tilting my saw upwards and saw the other side. So when sawing, uh, it's good to keep a sort of a, a loosey goosey grip. Okay, you don't have to don't 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 like squeeze it. It's not like a lemon. Okay, just uh, pretend you're holding an egg or something. And then you point your finger out like this for steadiness, and thumb in, thumb out. Doesn't really matter. Just a loosey goosey. Don't don't you know? Don't squeeze a lemon with the saw. And just. Cutting. So just let the weight of the saw do the cutting. Your arm should be relaxed. Don't don't tense up the elbow or arms or anything. Just go with the flow. Another way to keep the saw square is to look at the reflection. When I'm looking, um, the line goes from this line here, goes into the saw, and, and then this side of the line is an unbroken straight line from this side to this side, following the line of the reflection. This piece I'm cutting is going to be the leg of a portable bench. Well, I hope you found this useful. Uh, thanks for stopping by. See you next time.